her purse and this purse is too much update and um hey guys we are here with miss per purse or miss Persia's two month update and um she is actually two months two weeks and a day so say hi let's see how long she cooperates with us okay so we took her to the doctor today and let's first discuss her weight she <laughs> she is now 11 pounds and 11 ounces she's gonna act a fool y'all say hi say hi say, Mwah. <laughs> yeah she does not like to be held let's just put that out there right now she can't stand it so I'm trying to move fast look look at the paper yeah so she's 11 pounds and 11 ounces that puts her in a 70 percentile she um, is 23.5 inches now she was born 19.5 so she's grown her head is now 15.4 and it was 13.2 uh, and um, yeah so she's gotten taller and of course she's gotten bigger she was born only 5 uh, uh, 5 11 how, how much she made at birth 5 11 yeah 5 14 and now she's uh 11 11.11 11 pounds almost 12 pounds her feeding she eats four ounces now um, and she eats that every hour and a half she sleeps uh, about seven naps a day about an hour a piece and she has one big sleep at night she sleeps about six hours at night so we do get some good sleep now uh, troubles with her is she's teething already um, we had trouble burping her for the first year uh, first couple of months of her life or first month of her life but it's getting way better now um, she likes to scratch herself and other people pulls hair she likes to pull her own hair and she likes to pull our hair so she has that habit of course that's all babies but she's really really mean she's a, a little mean baby little mean baby she don't like to be held y'all like this is probably getting on her nerves. this is mm -mm. this is a no no for her okay I tried to keep her into the update but she ain't having it um she poops twice a day <laughs> she has like blowouts like when she does have them they're like blowouts and she blows out her clothes yeah she's in size three month clothes so like all her newborn stuff really don't fit anymore like like these little type things right here no they are too small like yeah so she is in like three month clothes and up C -c -c mainly because they aren't long enough um, they're not long enough and she has some big arms too uh, also her milestones she turns her head from side to side she does not like tummy time I can get her on her stomach and she'll last for about 50 seconds if that I'm gonna actually say about 45 seconds and then she's like screaming and flailing um, she coos all day she will talk back to you if you talk to her she now adds in like uh, word sounds so now she says mama mama so so cute um, she fights like if she if you try to feed her and she doesn't want it she'll just knock the bottle out of your hand and she almost broke one of the glass ones because she's just like she'll just jerk and just knock it out of your hand like I don't want that and I'm evil <laughs> um she sings like when you turn on music she sings like sings with it I mean not like who I mean like straight singing with it which is crazy um she keeps her hands open now you know it's a big thing with newborns they keep their hands closed she keeps them open and when she do keep them closed if they're close for too long they'll get lint and dirt in between them and so you have to clean in her folds she's she's kind of fat I mean she's not fat but I mean she's fat and so she has like all these rolls and you have to get under them or they'll get lint and dirt everywhere so like even in her hand it would like be some lint or dirt so I have to clean her hands daily which of course I do anyway when she wash up but still even through the day I have to open up her hands and clean them when she does keep them closed um she, like I said she doesn't like to be held she loves her stroller she loves her stroller so much like if she's crying like and don't want to be held we'll put her in the stroller uh she loves car rides she loves to be in and she's back okay she loves car rides and she hates to get dressed she don't mind you putting her pants and socks and all that stuff on and she just do not like to um get nothing put over her head like her shirt and stuff she hates that and anything touching her arm she hates um, she loves bath time. Oh my gosh, she loves bath time so much. Um, 
Yeah, she's now her dad is good with her when she's sleepy. So at nighttime, he's good with rocking her to sleep. With me, she's good in the daytime when she's up and active. She would prefer me. Um, she hates her swing music. She was loving her swing for a minute, and then the next thing I know, she started screaming every time we would play it. And so we just, um, yeah, she would scream every time we would turn on her swing music and we couldn't figure out why she was crying with it and she just hates the music. She likes the swing still, but she absolutely hates the music. Oh, okay, and she hates this position right here too. She does not like to be held like this. Anything on her stomach, she gets mad. She's gonna start cutting up in a minute. Um, last things is she laughs and she smiles now when she feel like it. And usually it's when she's looking at stuff in my makeup station. She loves like the makeup station, like my makeup station. She loves everything over there because of all the, the butterflies and stuff I have. So, yeah. So that's it. Say hi. Look at them cheeks. Say hi. <laughs> and she has on three month old pants now. So, but anyway, I'm gonna go. Cause she's gonna act a fool. <laughs> so, off we go again. So, talk to you guys in the next video. We'll come back with her three month update. I forgot I had a baby and you guys probably wanna hear the portion of my update. Me, I'm doing good. I'm still losing weight. I've lost since then about another six pounds altogether since I've been back. So altogether, I've lost about 50 something pounds. Yeah, a lot of weight um, since I've had her. Um, or while I was pregnant with her and after I had her. So I'm steady going down in weight. I haven't gained anything. Um, I eat what I want to. I don't really exercise, but I do. I have been getting out a little bit more. And of course, I'm exercising with her all day because I'm up and down. And we have taken some strolls out. Uh, and I am happy to be back in jeans again. And I am moving down in size in jeans. Whereas I was in like a 28 when I first got here. I'm down to like a 22 to a 24. Like the ones I have on now, I think it's 24. But they could be smaller. And they, and all the jeans that I have on are like large at the bottom and stuff. So I have to get some skinny jeans now. Um, which of course I used to be in a size 18, 16, 16, 18, so that's not really like a big accomplishment, but it's better than being in a 28 when I first got here. Um, I wouldn't have my last pap for the year after having a baby and, um, everything was fine. Everything looked good. And my cervix has closed back up and, um, birth control. I didn't do any birth control because I haven't, I've never taken birth control. I've never have. I've always been married and I didn't think I could have any more kids after my daughter and 14 years went by and I didn't have any more kids. Um, so I'm not saying that, that I'm gonna, you know, we'll use regular ready to go contraceptives that you can get from the stuff, condoms, things like that. So until, cause I just, I don't, I've never taken a pill. I'm not trying to mess with my body with hormones. So we'll just do it the old school way. Um, and yeah, that's about it with me. Um, I had my breast exam, everything was fine. They did give me some medicine cause I did develop some ulcers. Um, but that's from eating hot sauce in combination with a carbonated beverage, which I have not had carbonated drinks like pop or anything like that. I was drinking this apple cider. That's the little apple ciders and they carbonated and I had two of them, two little ones. And um, they messed my stomach up and um, I ha I'm back on ulcer medication, which I have taken before. So I have a year's worth of Prilosec. Um, I'm still taking the prenatal vitamins. So I'll be taking them probably for the rest of my life. And... Um, because they have everything I need in them. And um, as far as breastfeeding and breast milk, I stopped that last month. My milk dried up from pumping. Yeah, it dried up. And there's no way she could latch on to my breast, okay? Yeah. My breasts are huge. And I know people say, oh, it doesn't matter the size. Well, when you wear a 50K, you let me know if you breastfeed or not. Until then, I don't want to hear nothing about breastfeeding with these size breasts. Okay, so yeah, that's about it. That's all my update. And that was all her update. And I'll talk to you guys for real now in the next video.